thanks for coming to my channel. My name is Lady Leah. I'm out here giving my take on love and relationships and self-awareness. Uh, subscribe to my channel. Uh, hit uh, subs uh, notification uh, in my bio. You can check out my other links to my website, uh, social media, Facebook, Instagram. Follow me on those also. And today, the name of this video, the name of this video is Be Aware of Snakes. There's all kind of snakes that we have to be aware of. I was just looking at, a, I was reading some scriptures the other day, and I was reading a book, book of Acts, reading about Paul, how do you everybody know about the story when Paul got bit by a snake. How, you know, they, they were shipwrecked. Him and about 200 or so people, they were shipwrecked. And, you know, um, they didn't really trust Paul and believe what Paul had to say. Paul believed in God for hardly. And they didn't believe in what Paul had to say. And so they got shipwrecked. If, if they... If they had just listened to Paul, maybe they wouldn't have got shipwrecked. They would have got to where they was going. They were traveling to Rome. And so they got they they got on this island and they was hungry for weeks and wet and and just, you know, they wasn't at home. They were shipwrecked. They didn't know what to do. So Paul decided to build a fire. So he got some some sticks, some twigs or branches um um and started a fire and so when he started the fire a snake came out of the fire and bit him on his arm and they thought that paul got bit because you know he's doing wrong things and you know he's this he that so that's why he got bit but he shook he shook the snake off of him and it turns out that Paul was okay. And so that that's starting me to think, you know, the snakes come out of fire. The snake came out of that fire. That's like in our own lives. When you are hot, you're su successful. You're on fire. You're doing the most. You this, you that. You're climbing a corporate ladder. Excuse me. You're being successful in your business. You got a lot going on. And that's when the snakes reveal itself. Because a snake can't take the heat. You are the heat. You are the fire. And wherever there's fire, snake reveals. A snake draws from the fire because he can't be he can't be contained for so long. He got to get from from beneath that fire, and you're the fire, and you drew out the snakes. And there's all kind of different snakes, and I've been I wrote down some stuff here that about some snakes. Everybody know the popular rattlesnake. Rattlesnake. When it comes slivering, do 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 do. You hear the the little rattle that's on its tail. It makes noise. Ba -da 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 that's a rattlesnake. You can hear it when it's coming. That's like somebody in your life, always making noise. They always got. They they know so much. They got so much to say. They they know. They just doing the most. They know everything. They'll tell you do this. They'll tell you do that. And no, and it should be done this way. And no, it should be done that way. And, and you know, they just the loudest in the crowd. That's a rattlesnake. You hear people make that, that phrase a lot. Or, or, he ain't nothing but old rattlesnake. Making noise. they bite with that noise. Make a judgment on your life. Telling you what you should do. Telling you what you shouldn't do. 
tell you how you should do it, tell you why you shouldn't do it. Okay? That's a rattlesnake. Always coming after what you know. Always trying to debate, you know, what you want to do in your life. Always want to debate um, because you have an idea or you have a vision, you know, uh, you have a purpose. You have things going on that you want to do, you want to achieve. And that rattlesnake always there to tell you differently. Always tell, there to tell you, no, you shouldn't do it. That's one snake you need to get away from. Somebody that's loud and always wrong. Loud and wrong. Loud and wrong. Okay? And then another snake I had was a copper snake. A copper snake is, they, they're very reserved. Okay? They like to, they, they, they like to be in like, um, the wood, they, you find them in the woods. They like to be under debris and branches. That's where they hide, under debris and branches and, and trash and things like that, right? You will not get bit by a copper snake unless you go into its territory. You go, you, you decide you want to go on a nature walk and you start to go walking and you step on some branches and, and, and some debris and then out come a copper, copperhead snake and you might get bit because you stepped into its territory. You stepped into its home. So that's just like a person. You going to acquire some information. You you going to research some information. You want to um, uh, go online. You want to take a course. You want to take a class. You know you want information. You 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 ask a certain person, can you help me? And hopefully this did you in the right direction. But nine times out of ten. Him being a copperhead snake, he's not. Because you came into his territory, now he's going to bite you. You came looking for knowledge, now he's going to steer you the wrong way. You came looking for, for um, a solution, now he's going to steer you in the wrong direction. You came to do something to get some information to better your business, to better your your uh, uh, your job to better something better to better your kids to better your school to better your household anything that's to better you you going to inquire about it you going to seek information you going to seek that person that you think is in your corner and then they bite you that's a copperhead you came into their domain now they bite you you came to ask them questions now they bite you you came to get information, you came to get solutions, and then they bite you. But you wasn't aware of it. But you stepped into their domain. That's just like a copperhead snake. You stepped into their domain. You stepped into the debris. You stepped into um, um, the branches and tree limbs and, and rocks and... and, and uh, uh, garbage and things like that. How comes that snake? How comes that snake? That's a copperhead snake. You going to seek information and they they steering you the wrong way. That's a copperhead. We got to be careful of these these type of people. And then the last one that I that I was reading about was uh um a cross uh snake uh uh greatest a uh, gator snake those snakes oh my god a coral snake a garter snake whatever they want to call it. i say coral they are so pretty to look at they are nice colors of blues and turquoise and and 
yellows and orange and just look so pleasing to the eyes. Look so pleasant to the eyes. But they're not as dangerous. They don't appear to be that dangerous. And those type of snakes I heard don't even really really bite humans. They they really bite their um after the prey that they you know their food or whatever they're going after. That's what they really really um go after and go bite. They don't bite humans as much. But they're still a snake. That's that person that's walking around your office, always dressing nice in nice suits, hair always done, laid back, hair, makeup just on point. Everything they say is good. Everything they do is good. They look good. They smell good. They just good all around. They so sweet. They always smiling. That's a coral snake. Be careful of those too. They always in your corner. They always there to help. They always have a solution. They always have a way. Just because they look good, they're pleasing to the eyesight. So we more adapt to that. We, we adapt to pretty looking things. We adapt to good looking things, good looking people. So just because they look good, man or female, don't mean that they are good. So just be mindful of different types of snakes in our lives. We all have them. We all have them. We just have to be aware. They ain't going nowhere because you on fire. Snakes come out of that fire. They're going to reveal, they're going to be revealed in that fire. You on top, you moving, you not slowing down, you not looking back, you staying focused, and that's why the snake is there. But just be careful that snake, they bite. Just try, try not to get bit. Try not to get bit. Okay? Talk to you later.